Okay, and welcome back, everyone. I hope you all enjoyed your commercial break, and welcome back to Good Morning, New Hampshire. Let's get ready for your entertainment news. Kylie Jenner turns heads as a sexy skeleton at epic Halloween house party with Tyga and Kendall. See the pic. Let's take a listen to the video from Entertainment Tonight. Brothers to chip in. All AF did was vote to block efforts combating climate change. The Kardashian Jenner clan went all out for Halloween. Kylie Jenner pulled out all the stops for the holiday, throwing her first dead dinner at her Hidden Hills mansion Friday night. The menu and decor was filled with gory goodness for Kylie's guests. Shrimp eyeball cocktails, a deadly dessert bar, and a few more gooey treats. Lizzle and boyfriend Tyga dressed as skeletons for the occasion, with the 19-year-old reality star sporting a sexy lace gown to complement her blonde hair and deadly contoured face. Kendall Jenner stopped by her sister's get-together before heading to Kate Hudson's annual Halloween bash in L.A. The model opt for a sexy goth costume showing off major cleavage in a low-cut latex dress, fishnet stockings, and platform boots. Okay, and there you go on that report. Now let's take a look at your celebrity birthdays for today. And your celebrity birthdays for today, Janelle Parrish is 28. Diego Maradona is 56. E. Edge is 43. Jack Brand is 14. Ivanka Trump is 35. Nia Long is 46. Nastia Luyakin is 27. Giamma Tubes is 15. And Kyle Swart is 17. Those are your celebrity birthdays for today. Happy birthday to those celebrities. Now let's take a look at your national day calendar for October 30th. Today is National Candy Corn Day. And we have some candy corn right here. Let's eat some right here. Mm. Happy National Candy Corn Day, everyone. It's also Speak Up for Service Day. It's also National Publicist Day. M. Those are your national days on your national calendar for October 30th. Now let's take a look and see what's trending online for your Sunday morning. James Cormie got one M people talking about this. USBS. Got 9.2K people talking about this. American Bison got 882K people talking about this. Hashtag We Survive. Kennedy Clinton Dinner. Michigan got 118 tweets. Hashtag Go Hillary got 5,141 tweets. Dartmouth got 1,741 tweets. Merrimack 
Hashtag run with the Marines got 1,015 tweets. Hashtag Santa's other jobs got 2,714 tweets. Hashtag Sunday morning got 6,442 tweets. In Marine Corps Marathon, and that's what's trending online for your Sunday morning. And let's take a look at the 27 common Halloween candy, best and worst. At 27 is two teas, anything. At 26, Mike and Ike. At number 25 is Twizzlers. At number 24, Almond Joy. At number 23, Raisinets. At number 22, Mounds. At number 21, Smarties. At number 20, Nestle's Crunch. At number 19, Laffy Taffy. At number 18, Hershey Mercerus. At number 27, Candy Corn. At number 16, Butterfinger. At number 15, Nerds. At number 14, M&M's. Mmm. At number 13, Sour Patch Kids. At number 12, Three Musketeers. At number 11, Hershey Kisses. At number 10, Reese Peanut Butter Cups. At number 9, Snickers. At number 8, Gummy Bears, at number 7, Jolly Ranchers, at number 6, Cowtails, at number 5, Skittles, mmm, at number 4, Milky Way, at number 3, Twix, at number 2, Starburst, and at number 1, Kit Kat. And we want to hear from all of you. Let us know what your favorite Halloween candy is. Just comment below under the videos or send me a message and let me know what your favorite Halloween candy is. Now let's take a look at some events happening today in New Hampshire. It's a wonderful life at 7.30 p.m. in Epping. Craft retreat at 2 p.m. in Pittsburgh. All Things Pumpkin Festival at 12 p.m. in Jackson. Return of the Pumpkin People at 7 a.m. in Jackson area. Wicked Woods Weekend at 3 p.m. in Bretton Woods. Helicopter Fall Foliage Tours at 7 o'clock a.m. in Portsmouth. Musquans on the bank at 5.30 p.m. in Portsmouth. And those are events happening in New Hampshire today. If you want to read more about those events, just go to visitnewhampshire.gov and then go under what to do and then click on the event calendar. And that does it for Good Morning New Hampshire. I hope you all enjoyed this edition of Good Morning New Hampshire and have a great rest of your Sunday. Goodbye, everyone.